today we are discussing questions and answers for Microsoft administering relational databases DP300. You can download the complete list of Microsoft based questions from the link provided in the description. Our question is you have an always on availability group deployed to Azure virtual machines. The availability group contains a database named DB1 and has two nodes named SQL1 and SQL2. SQL1 is the primary replica. You need to initiate a full backup of DB1 on SQL2. Which statement should you run? Now see the options as option A, option B, C, D. Correct answer is option B. Our next question is you plan to move 200 GB databases to Azure. You need to dynamically scale resources consumption based on workloads. The solution must minimize downtime during scaling operations. What should you use? Option A and Azure SQL database elastic pool. Option B SQL Server on Azure Virtual Machines. Option C and Azure SQL Database Managed Instance. Option D Azure SQL Databases. Correct answer is option A. Our next question is you have 10 Azure Virtual Machines that have SQL Server installed. You need to implement a backup strategy to ensure that you can restore specific databases to other SQL Server instances. The solution must provide centralized management of the backups. What should you include in the backup strategy? Option A Automated Backup in the SQL Virtual Machine Settings Option B Azure Backup Option C, Azure Site Recovery. Option D, SQL Server Agent Jobs. Correct answer is option B. Our next question is you need to recommend an availability strategy for an Azure SQL database. The strategy must meet the following requirements. Support failovers that do not require client applications to change their connection strings. Replicate the database to a secondary Azure region. Support failover to the secondary region. What should you include in the recommendation? Option A failover groups. Option B transactional replication. Option C availability zones. Option D, Geo Replication. Correct answer is option A. Our next question is drag and drop. You have SQL Server on an Azure Virtual Machine that contains a database named DB1. DB1 is 30 TB and has a 1 GB daily rate of change. You back up the database by using a Microsoft SQL Server agent job that run transact SQL commands. You perform a weekly full backup on Sunday daily differential backups at 1 p.m. and transaction log backups every 5 minutes. The database fails on Wednesday at 10 a.m. Which three backups should you restore in sequence? To answer, move the appropriate backups from the list of backups 
to the answer area and arrange them in the correct order. Now see this section. And this is the correct answer. If you are preparing for any Microsoft based certifications, you can download the complete list of valid tried and tested questions and answers from the link provided in the description below.